I'm not. You have that same steam roller jean as your mom. And the donut recipe. <laughs> and you. Allie, I promise I'm not going to let you down. Vice versa. <laughs> Why don't you two just get a room? Every wish is your command. You sound like a broken record. Hi, honey. How'd it go? Just so you know, you're talking to the new CEO of the Mira Enterprises. Don't you mean co-CEO? Okay, Gabby. Just telling the truth. Everything she said is true. She is the one I want, and I love her. I love her more than I've loved anybody in my entire life. And I'm not gonna hide it anymore. I'm sorry, I, I only stayed with you because I, I felt guilty leaving you after everything that Kristen did to you, and you're still not over it. Oh, do you mean the blindness? Yes, I'm sorry, kid, I can't, I can't live a lie anymore. You know what? I can't either. I'm not blind. I never have been. What? What the hell? But no, 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 no. You should not have been faking it this entire time. That's exactly what I was doing. Oh, my God. You really are the biggest bitch I've ever known. <laughs> and you two are the most craven, obnoxious, self-serving creatures I've ever known. I mean, how the hell could you do this to me, to everybody? Well, it wasn't hard, actually. I think I did a rather good job, really. I mean, there were a few times where I slipped, but then I covered really well. Oh, my God. Yeah. Life is really funny, isn't it? One second, you're the CEO of an international enterprise with me by your side, and then suddenly, you're a bum again. With that by your side. Oh, how the mighty have fallen. Like sand through the hourglass, so are the days of our lives. Faking being amnesia, so actually, unfortunately, I saw the two of you going at it like two dogs in heat, and I don't think I'm going to be able to get that out of my head. Oh, good. But why? Why pretend? Payback? Did you really think that I would let you have your happily ever after without any kind of payback at all? Do you have any idea what you put him through? Yeah, I do, because I was watching. You were disgusting. Wow, really? Because you had it coming to you. Do you know what that felt like to wake up from a coma and hear the two of you discussing your future together? Because that was nauseating. I almost died, and yet all you two could talk about was yourselves. Oh, yeah, like you're so selfless. I was. I was. I put you and your career in front of everything. I would have put the world at your feet, but... You chose her. So, yeah, absolutely, it needed to be addressed. I'm on the phone. Can you wait outside? I think I'll wait here. Sure. What the hell? I'm so sorry. You were saying? Oh, I was just saying that I think you could do it. Not without you. Samantha, I'm sorry. I've got to go. I'll see you later at the house. 
Maybe we can find a way to celebrate. Well, I think we should start with champagne. And see where that takes us. I love you, Samantha. I love you too, E.G. I really think I'm going to be sick right now. What the hell do you think you're doing? Well, it's only been 10 minutes since our board meeting. I'm already having some serious concerns about our working relationship. Uh, well, we should get some counseling. Yeah, one of my biggest concerns is you being a condescending jerk. Well, there's a door. Right, see, I, I know what you know, EJ. What I'm trying to do is clean up the mess that Jake left. I mean, you needed to get Tony to go along, so you made him think you'd be willing to work with me as co-CEO. Well, then maybe you should stop whining and stop working. You didn't leave a bed of pain or your opulent villa in Italy to be co-anything. I, I, I know you're trying to get rid of me. Why would you say that, Mama? I thought Ellie and I explained to you we're just friends. I know, I know. But in case that that changes, there's a sale of men right over there. Yeah, there Soon to be under new management, but I'm sure they have plenty of available room. No, one thing you'll learn about my mother is she loves to flog a joke to death, especially if it isn't funny the first time. Sorry, I cannot just. Tiptoe around, afraid of saying the wrong thing. See, I can't change my nature any more than you can. No one in the world knows that better than I do. <laughs> These biscuits are delicious. Mm -hmm. Chanel might actually have a good shot at making a go at the bakery. From your mouth to God's ears. Maybe she will finally make enough money to move out. out. Yeah. <laughs> and then it will just be the four of us. That sounds like heaven to me. You know, no one likes steakhouse. Well, last night was extremely hard. I just kept thinking about you and the twins and her bed. We missed you too. It's boring, but I'll miss it. Mm, no. Actually, um, <laughs> I got some, um, some pretty interesting news. Oh, God. What does Chanel do now? It actually wasn't Chanel. It was my Aunt Paulina. <laughs> She's sleeping with my dad. <laughs> 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 